Minister of Nash of Health, Terence de Alsing, says there are no plans to return to COVID-19 restrictions despite new positive cases of the virus this week. The new cases have no links to international travel. Minister de Alsing says there is no need to panic, but there is need for concern. Ian Wayson has more. Five more persons have tested positive for COVID-19, and they are all primary contacts of patient 142. Chief Medical Officer Dr. Roshan Parasra made the disclosure at the Ministry of Health media conference on Saturday morning. Despite the rise in cases without recent travel history, Minister of Health Terence Dial Singh allayed concerns that Trinidad and Tobago would be returning to COVID-19 restrictions. We are not at this time contemplating any further lockdown of the economy, any further restrictions. We are just simply asking that these simple public health measures be adopted as a way of life. Mr. Dial Singh also stated the parallel health care system is ready for the rise in cases. He explained as it stands, the beds in the parallel health care system are about 5% capacity. So the capacity that we have kept in reserve knowing that we could always expect the virus to manifest itself, the parallel healthcare system is in place to treat with any upsurge in local COVID cases. During the media conference, the health minister announced that the one visitor per patient policy will be enforced. He stressed it does not mean one patient at a time, but one patient per day at the parallel healthcare system. In addition to these measures, visits to homes for the aged are not allowed. Minister Dial Singh said while the wearing of masks is still not mandatory, it is strongly recommended and the no mask, no service policy should be observed. He also apologized to the entertainment industry as he explained the government was ready to reopen that sector. But events from Wednesday to today have now put that on the back burner. And I really feel for those in the entertainment industry. They will have to wait a little while longer. Ian Wason, TTT News. Thank you very much, Ian. The Catholic Education Board of Management has confirmed that all members of teaching staff, all Standard 5 students, and all of the personnel who were on duty at the Maraval RC Primary School are to be tested for COVID-19. In a media release, Chief Executive Officer... Sharon Mangrew confirms that a standard five student at Maraval RC School and his family tested positive for COVID-19. The Catholic Board says the last time any student or, or school staff member would have been in direct contact with the students who tested positive would have been Wednesday, July 22nd. All students of the standard five class have been ordered to remain under quarantine. The Catholic Board says the Ministry of Health or the Regional Health Authority will begin swabs for COVID-19 on Sunday. In addition, the Maraval RC Church will be fumigated and professionally sanitized on Monday, along with the RC Parish Church, which is on the same compound as the school. The Catholic Board advises of an abundance of caution. All masses at the parish church would have been cancelled for this weekend with immediate effect. 